Like, we are live. How about you take this first mid zoom? Alright, I'm gonna watch... Yeah, let's watch P. Lovely at mid. Who's gonna be that soldier for red? So that's gonna be John Madden. We'll see. He's not really doing the fast loader. He's just using that whip there. Um, discipline reaction. He bombs in. Gets the rocket jump up on the crate. Oh, and he immediately gets sniped by Hip Hop. Already showing his skill. He was number one. Takes out Evan. A lot of damage coming through. Uh, for Squirrel Squad. But Battle Bull takes down the sentry. <laughs> Couple frags coming out. Oh, Bronze gets taken out, and it looks like this is going to be a mid for John Madden, as I called, potentially. Mm -hmm. I especially love this aggressive heavy play battle bull up there on the crates denying jumpers. We do have an uber popped out over here, both ubers coming out from blue and from red, but it's a demo, demo heavy versus just a demo uber, as it looks like. John Madden will be sort of getting this mid, but we will have an extended mid fight going up here. The blue demo jumps on here, tries to pull down, Drake goes down. <laughs> Another person goes down as well, that would have been the heavy vanilla love, and so that was a really nice aggressive repush going on from them. Both soldiers are running black box, as per the uh, usual sort of meta going on here, and I really think Battle Bull might have helped his win, his team win that mid, just due, his, due to his aggressive stancing and keeping those jumpers off his meta, as well as Heap Hop getting that really nice snipe early on. Yeah, I guess I was right, they did win the mid, but then they just got slaughtered immediately after and just lost it. <laughs> <laughs> did you see that reflect? Zukima killing Bronze with a really nice refract rocket from his soldier. We do have the blue pushing in here onto Mini Spire, getting aggressive, Cole taking people down, Heap Hop picking up another snipe, winning that sniper duel versus Fair Affer. And we do have a really significant advantage in the form of Malin, but it doesn't matter because both teams are down a significant amount of players. We do have the Spy over here in the form of Evan trying to get a little bit of pressure on the point. Maybe he'll try and move in onto the combo, but uh, it looks like they'll finally be able to take the second point after a bit of fighting, but Red is probably going to re-push this as soon as they can if they manage to get that Uber Force out. Yeah, nice snipe there by Heap Hop taking down the best fun in the game. Bronze gets a uh, flank kill. And Heap Hop gets another snipe on DCSY. Bronze putting in pressure here. Uh, gonna see if he can go back and cap up that point once he gets some heals from his med. Mm -hmm. um, we're gonna see if they can cap this point. Now they got some three cap time here. Uh, now I'm gonna watch the spy here on red, who will be Rolls Royce. Mm -hmm. Really good size. Play there by Braun, singing out ODB, making sure his team has a little bit more leeway to push Rose in. Rose has eyes on the med, he has eyes on the med. Oh man, it's gonna happen. Oh, he gets the demo, nice. Uh, Braun uh. Get, gets immediately taken out by Bronze, but still demo, pretty good pick there for the spy. Oh, absolutely. Keeping that demo down means that they won't be able to push in nearly as much. Where is our sentry set up? We do have a level 2 sentry set up in sort of the standard position on the left side, watching over the point and lobby, so that's really good. Heavy setup. Uh, Medic is playing, you know, fairly, fairly aggressively, fairly forward. His demo peeking into rollout, and we do have 100% Uber on both sides. So now it's a point of picks. Farfer does get DJ down, so that is something. And uh, we're just we're playing the waiting game. We're waiting for someone to make a mistake and somebody to capitalize on it. That's pretty much how last works. And um, Squirrel Squad just trying to get their spawns here, see if they can get that key pick to push in off of. Uh, we're gonna see some. Oh, nice snipe here. Hip Hop takes down Zuchima. Hip Hop already showing his worth with a seven kill streak. He was number That's... one, takes down Evan. Snipe on Zuchima is a really nice pick without a pirate air blast, especially in an Uber v Uber situation. Maybe it's not enough to push in off of, but it's definitely. Oh, Hip Hop picking up the snipe onto ODB. That's a demo down. Granted, it, both demos are down, but still. Maybe that's enough to move in off of? Nah, looks like we're pretty content to just sit back and uh, play it until we have a lot more of a numbers advantage or disadvantage here. Yeah, this is... It's always tough pushing out a last. They had, a, like, maybe two, three player advantage there, but... I think they're going for that full wipe and really to shut down one of Squirrel Squad's pushes to actually go in for that second recap, but we'll see what happens here. Mm -hmm. Fair after on the Machina rotating a lot. Go ahead. Oh yeah, we're just gonna see who makes the first big move here, as, I don't know, I'm not sure what's gonna happen. Uh, not quite, Farafter's rotating quite a lot with his Machina trying to get a snipe off of someone at least. 
Evan does go down. I don't think he... No, he is DRing right now. He pop goes down to Farrakhar. Pretty nice play right there. So that means his team can peak quite a bit more. And they're taking Rose a Royce bit more has on the med again. Oh, man. Uh, he's hiding in under this ramp. Behind enemy lines. We're going to see if he's going to go for this med pick again. Not really moving right now. Just standing there. Has eyes on the med. Oh, man. Oh, that positioning. The med's right below him. Cloak and dagger, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I mean, some people call it the cloak and do nothing, so I can see why. Whoa. I I'd uh, say it's pretty important. Darn it, he got caught out. I would say cloak and dagger is pretty important just because it gives a spy ability to call. Okay, we do have an aggressive stance over here. The Uber does get popped out of shut shutter. Demo, Pyro, flashing all over the place. The Uber does get forced out as well, but nobody is taking care of that sentry, so that'll keep people from putting pressure on the point. It looks like Blue Team is going to have to try and rotate out of here as uh, people are kind of going down left and right. ODB went down at that, as did Vanilla Love, the Red Heavy. And we do have some aggression in the form of Battle Bull and his medic and sniper still holding out here in shutter trying to make stuff happen we have a wrangled mini sentry in rollout we do have time on point the spy trying to do stuff the sentry did go down as well and so it's just kind of a mad scramble trying to get the spawns up trying to get more advantage that mini sentry really kind of helped out a lot as we do have the soldier pyro on point will he cap it no looks like vanilla love decided to say no to that with his oh, mini gun and oh scout and braun picks up that last cap wow that was pretty that was pretty quick actually. That was really impressive <laughs> by Squirrel Squad. Let's see who we're gonna watch here on this mid. I'm gonna watch um ODB. See if he can make this deficit and equalize the score. <clears throat> Take some fall damage on that rollout, but he's getting some nice traps set there for his posing demo. As they mm. will be the first to get to mid. Takes out takes out the mini already. ODB gets some nice damage. Lovely taking down Evan. Heavy and Med now up on the crate there for Squirrel Squad, trying to pressure, but some pipes are being spammed there by ODB. Absolutely, that aggressive sort of heavy play really kind of helps. Heap Hop takes a pick off the engineer. Fair offer goes down, Rolls Royce goes down, so that is a pretty good advantage, but it doesn't matter because the Squirtle Squad's uh, demo man kind of went down a bit earlier in that fight. And we do have that aggressive heavy in the form of Battle Bull, who is pretty lit. He may have to back down. So this may be another case of the Uber does get popped out. Zukima gets sniped as he gets unflashed, and it looks like they will be using this Uber defensively. John Madden returned. <laughs> electing to retreat through sewers instead to fight another day. Yeah, they had the numbers advantage, but they knew the other team had the Uber, and so they thought they'd save their players the uh, <clears throat> the chore of dying, and they'd back up and re-push when they get their own Uber. Absolutely. And that gives Mallet a huge Uber advantage moving in here with his team, but uh, the numbers are up. We do have a little bit of aggression coming out from ODB, peaking a little bit over there. We do still have the wrangled minis on both sides. Must be quite a pain. We do have a really cheeky trap over here on Rock by the red choke, so maybe somebody will fall to that. Who knows? Yeah, we'll see if we get this sewer push as we see... Oh, the uh, Angie Nest here, the Spy's contesting. Uh, Angie versus Spy, Dead Ring comes out. Oh, and now it looks like there is a sewer push coming here. Uh, Demo and Med pushing in through the sewer, destroying this Nginess and Philosophy Major. Yeah, we may see this sewer push here. Interesting line of play. But Red Team has a, a sticky trap waiting for them. Absolutely. Both medics are sitting at 100% Uber. Evan is running around with his DR, trying to get some more aggressive days in here. And we do have a strong sewer presence in the form of Squirtle Squad. I'm going to take a look at our snipers over here. Rolls Royce is in kind of position to make something happen. He gets caught out. Nice play there by DJ, finding the spy and keeping his medic a little bit alive. However, Zukima also catches out Evan at the same time. So it looks like these spies won't be having a really nice time here on process. Uh, Cole gets taken down by a mini sentry. So uh, that's definitely not something to write home about as we are just sort of playing the waiting game. A little bit of aggression from the pyro in here. Nobody's really moved in to make a big pick quite yet, but we do have Heap Hop over here peeking out of sewers, trying to get something done. Yeah, um, Cole was trying to get that big pick, but it was kind of laughably, laughably a fail. So, stalemate here. Still that strong sewer presence. I am gonna watch Farrafur to see if he can get some snipes over on the other the opposing team. <laughs> 
I don't know if anything about that was laughable, man. Those knockback on the mini, or sorry, that knockback on those mini is definitely something spooky. Crazy little gun, especially with the Wrangler equipped. We do have Evan DRing and Choke trying to get something, and we do have, oh man, it looks like Blue is instead of rotating to try and maybe push through IT. Looks like Malin is going to be taking his Pyro and Demo and trying to take an aggressive stance on those catwalks. His Pyro, however, runs into Vanilla Love who does not taken down, and instead it looks like they're going to be trying to get a good angle through here. It looks like Sura wasn't really working out for them, which makes sense because of just the sort of snipe ability of those sight lines, as well as the stickies being laid down from Mini Spire. And so we're going to have quite a bit of aggression going on here in the upper IT area. Maybe they're going to be pushing out? Not quite. We don't have any sort of picks or advantage to move off of. We do have the aggressive sort of spy play moving in here. Rolls Royce trying to edge his way in through Choke. He has eyes on the Medic. I don't know if he'll be able to get anything, though. There are just players all over the place. Hopefully, he'll be able to get something done before he gets caught out. Yeah. Uh, lovely taking down Evan here. And um, <laughs> I'm still watching Farrah for at this Choke, see if he can get a nice snipe. Yeah, he's using that Machina, which will give him that extra damage, and also, oh, he takes down Evan, potentially, unless that was a DR. Um, oh, Bomb coming in here from Cole. Very and nice, ODB especially. takes out Cole, he pop, gets the snipe on, he was number one. Mm -hmm. Especially with Zuki Nadam, that's a really nice uh, opportunity oh, to bomb him. Out here. Oh. <laughs> uh, Blue Uber comes off and the red exchange. Red's gonna get the better of this Uber by a lot, and Blue needs to back up and spare some lives. Uh, bomb coming in here, uh, but getting uh, utterly rejected by the Battle Bull. Absolutely, DJ getting a really nice flare off onto Vanilla of the Red Heavy going in here. So it looks like this point will quite easily go to Squirtle Squad. We have some long range stickies getting thrown out. Uh, the Red Scout being taken down, and people just got their spawns over here on John Mad. We have the aggressive bomb in from Cole. He's trying to see what he can do. Tries to get the medic, but no, he gets absolutely denied. So really nice team play going on there. Bronze gets taken down by Vanilla Love's minigun. Again, we have a heavy v heavy fight, and Battle Bull gets sniped by Rolls Royce, who is on the Ambassador. Really nice shot from there, and that'll be a really successful defense. Mallet did go down, so that means Drake has a good solid 80% uber advantage before Malant spawns and begins healing again and they'll probably be able to push in and retake second off this. Yeah, I think they may go for the repush. They got about 4k there. They're peeking out here. Uh, I don't know, Cole keeps going for those hero plays and it looks like he may get taken out here again. He's only at 3 HP, he's trying to find his med. Uh, okay, his med finds him. And DJ takes out Rolls Royce. <clears throat> Some interesting stuff going in here. The scout duel there in lobby. And Ooh, Cole bombing in again. He's trying to get it. Oh, he gets a nice rocket off on Drake. Drake with eight health. Trusting in his team does not pop uber crazy. I would have popped so hard right there. <laughs> oh yeah, me too. He's he's um. <clears throat> I mean, Cole keeps going for those hero plays, and he finally almost got it. That would have been an amazing pop, but certainly he, that guy has trust in his team. Mhm. Mm most definitely, we do have uh, Rolls Royce down here trying to move in through the lower lobby area, and we do have, you know, some trading of projectiles over here in lobby as well. Sentry's going down, rockets flying. Palovely is once more on the regular rocket launcher instead of the black box, so maybe he found that extra rocket to be a little useful in his uh, soldier be sold battles. And both medics are one more sitting at 100% Uber, so we'll see who gets more impatient first. That seems to be how it always is in Highland. If someone just gets tired, he pop, getting a nice snipe on Pharaoh after. And uh, that is a good chunk of people down for John Madden. Yeah, and the blue Uber comes out here. They decide that was enough, and the Ubers are exchanged. Red's going to get the better of this Uber. And um, blue retreats through ro the lobby, but now they're looping back around, trying to get this post-Uber damage on the other team. And they have some people on the point. Bronze dueling with the Pyro, taking out the Pyro, taking out the demo. And Bronze helps his team cap off to get that second win. Who do you want to watch here on mid? That snipe on Drake, though, towards the end, really nice going on there. I think I am going to be watching the blue demo, aliasing as philosophy major right now, which I think is a pretty solid career choice, if not a really common one. So he goes out there, nothing too fancy going out here. You know, gets it there at around the same time as Meta, Meta, the other demo, moving across point, throwing out some stickies. Nobody really going down quite so far. We do have the aggressive plays once more from Battle Bowl, and we do have the soldier 
on crit and ooh, Vanilla Love going down really quickly to Bronze and Rolls Royce getting the stab on Battle Bolt, finally taking down and Cole jumping in trying to get on somebody takes down Paul Lovely, so that is going to be a good play from him and Drake went down there as well, so this will be a really definitive mid catcher for Squirtle Squad. Yeah, the <laughs> wow, only two players up there for. For John Madden, and that was another definitive mid, and things are looking up there for Squirrel Squad. Absolutely. If they win, they will be going straight into another best of three. Cole over here being pretty aggressive in rollout. He's being denied by the heavy, however, and that was a nice use of momentum by Squirtle Squad to push into second as well and take that cap as far as possible. Drake still does not have Uber. The hazards of going down late in the mid fight, and Mallet does. However, they'll probably be able to get some uber going on here before they push him but it doesn't matter the uber is being pushed in through rollout avoids the sticky it looks like vanilla loves trying to be a bit of a potty block right here he's being chased it's ring around the rosy around the pole right here vanilla love with 22 health kind of wasted that uber on him and nobody else but cole over here trying to jump in he knows the medic forces the uber out and we do have people on point malin also gets headshot by pharaoh ever and that is a wow Almost a wipe from Squirtle Squad. We still have that mini up, and that is going to be taking down someone before it gets sapped. But finally, it looks like John Madden will be able to push out of last onto second and maybe turn this around. Yeah, good for them, man. But at least for Squirtle Squad, they were able to get that force, and so they won't immediately take mid here, John Madden or anything, but they will get that second recap. Uh, Palovely takes down Bronze. Uh, nice flank battle there. Oh, and Pharaoh Affer, the headshot, 5k right now. Uh, Snipes Cole. Absolutely, this is a really interesting point for snipers. Uh, definitely that choke point gives you a pretty nice sight line. And uh, we are going to get some aggressive posturing over here, you know, trying to get it. We do have sort of a re-push going on, however, so uh, trying to get a little bit of time. But I think that was a fluke as ODB. You know, gets that spy down. I believe that was a DR. Yes, Evan does finally go down to a rocket from Palovely, and we are taking a pretty um, passive hold over here on the side of Squirtle Squad. Looks like the med is only on mid. Battle Bull taking sort of defensive spot over here. Oh my god, Rolls Royce trying to get some. Finds Cole, whiffs the stab on the medic, and decides to go for the soldier instead. Hey, a pick is a pick, and it looks like Mount is going to be approaching 100% Uber. So maybe he'll get a little bit more aggressive with his team right here as they're looking in through choke. And the Uber does come out. Boom, that giant bomb in from Mr. Philosophy Major. And the Uber comes off on red as well. We're going to be throwing people around. Not many casualties from the Uber so far yet. Oh, the sticky snipe from ODB takes Malin down. Really nice over there. And the lovely just going on there. He prop getting sniped by Pharaoh after uh, ODB taking down DJ Bronze also being taken down. I believe that is a soda popper on John Madden's scout right now. And they're going to be going in cold. Oh, absolutely gets demolished by a super nice reflect from Zukima as well. Nice play and a potential back cap, but there's no chance at the 10 stack. Yeah, um, <clears throat> nice job there by, by uh, John Madden. And uh, Cole is going to rip in pepperoni now. <laughs> That's what he gets for being so aggressive. Looks like Tsukima learned his patterns and decided to stick around more. And uh, we are seeing Tsukima over here on the shotgun. Takes down DJ in that Pyro v Pyro. We are capping second over here. Battle Bull takes down Palovely, who was trying to do a cheeky sort of rollout jump like Cole was doing earlier. Wasn't really happening. And so we are going to be moving in here. It looks like Squirtle Squad does not have Uber yet. They're nowhere close. They're only at 50%, so maybe we're going to be seeing a push in here from John Matt. And it looks like the Uber is popped out onto the demo. ODB, we're trying to get that sentry down. It is wrangled. The sentry finally goes down, but we have Battle Bull over here looking over the point. But it doesn't matter because if there are bodies on point, you got to kill them before they cap. And they didn't. And that is a point to John Madden. Good job. Could be that momentum swing they really need. And that was really impressive. They went for that lobby push. I'm going to watch Philosophy Major here on mid and see if <clears throat> he can do a ni some nice damage to swing back the momentum in their favor. Just They just suffer that loss, so. He's getting some stickies placed. Uh, dead to sticks. Feral already getting the snipe on DJ, Blue Pyro. Um, Cole takes down Palovely. Uh, <clears throat> Red NG is on the crate right now with his mini, and he's gonna jump down. The best fun in the game's sentry takes down Evan. 
Yeah, and some nice picks coming here. Coming Ooh, out here. the air shot reflect! I'm sorry, but that was incredible. Yeah, Zuzuma the- pulling it out. Zukuma is, is wrecking Cole right now. I feel bad for him, kind of. Man, that so like, sorry. That looks like it's gonna be another mid for John Madden. And sorry for the interruption there. Uh, nice mini central placement really kind of tried to deny the dumpers over there. We do have 100% Uber on both sides. Fair effort gets, you know, the not he pop gets the best of them. And we do have the Uber popped out actually on the blue demo over here in Valley. That is going to be a significantly worse Uber for Squirtle Squad as it looks like Drake is going to decide to pop on his demo and Pyro being more aggressive, trying to take the pull in. It wasn't very too good of an Uber, you know, Pick-wise, however, and it looks like Bronze is trying to get in here, make something happen. It doesn't really matter, though. They're going to catch Mini Spire, but we are going to have an uber, you know, stalemate once more, pushing it to last. Cole jumps in, tries to get pretty aggressive. Zukima gets taken down by a nice pipe. ODB hits a sick pipe on Cole, taking him down as well, and Bronze is going to be going behind. He finds a pick on Drake. So forget what I said about an uber uh, stalemate once more. It's not happening, and it looks like this second point will stay Squirtle Squads. Oh, the body shot onto Mallet though. The uh, medic almost. Was that a drop? Oh, was that a drop? Tell me it wasn't a drop. I don't think it was a drop. No. Was it? No, it wasn't. It was really close though. He was uh, maybe 60, 70 before he finally got taken down. And it looks like we're going to have a slight uber advantage in, you know, for John Madden's side. You know, chasing people off of mid, say, you know, that's ours. We got the spawns to defend it with. And we're going to be trying to get a repush into second right here. Looks like we're not going to be having an uber fight whatsoever. We do have a level three being trying to put up up on that spot, but he gets taken down by a combination of stickies and a wrangled mini. And so we're just going to have John Madden sort of flooding this point. Fair after gets taken down. Oh, Cole trying to pump in. Tsukima hits another nice reflect and uh, doesn't quite kill him and Mallet takes down Rolls Royce but it doesn't matter because Evan is gonna get the revolver shot onto Drake and escape with his DR so it's only four up on terms of John Madden and uh, definitely just some stuff going on here we have the Red Soldier getting in on Mallet as well and he gets taken down by Hip Hop with a body shot and so we just don't have any medics on the board at all why do we need medics? <laughs> So yeah, just... medics are just crutches for bad players anyway. <laughs> um, we might finally see the cap on here. We do have a mini sort of setup. Looks like Ubi is going to snipe that. And finally, John Madden is going to cap that second point and get their team some forward spawns. And that was just a lot of really scrappy fighting on the side of both teams. Wow. Yeah. Um, this is looking pretty good for John Madden. Um... Kind of another stalemate here as both meds are trying to build up their uber. We see a slight advantage in the fa in the form of 20% about for, no, 10% for Drake. Not really going to uh, factor in that much as the opposing team probably does, is not, does not, <coughs> excuse me, is not aware of it. Evan takes down Pharaoh after. He pop gets the nice snipe on Palovely and the best find in the game is now dominating Evan. Absolutely. He pop sniping over there from spawn. Looks like he'll be a little bit more aggressive going into lobby. And uh, Farrafer finally does come up and we do have 100% uber advantage. We do have a level 3 up here on the last. It looks like Game Master is going to be running that Wrangler, Wrangler Rescue Ranger combo with his level 3 that so many people just really, really don't enjoy anymore. I've ever talks of that maybe potent could combination potentially being banned. And it looks like Mallet is just going to get really aggressive over here with this demo in rollout. They do have Uber. They do have a pick in the form of Fair Offer, but they decide to maybe just leave it for another day, leave it for a bigger advantage, and we'll just see who gets a bit more impatient first. He was number one, the scout, taking down Hip Pop with his uh, soda popper. AB popularizing that use over there in Platinum. And we are going to be seeing a little bit of movement over here in the lobby area. Maybe we're getting ready to push. Maybe, maybe not. Uh, hopefully they commit. We'll see what happens. Yeah, Farrafer gets a nice body shot on Bronze, and another body shot on Philosophy Major. Some nice picks coming out here. Equal Ubers right now. We're going to see when they make this push in. Uh, pressure on the point. You see the Wrangler. Red Uber comes out, and the quick fix responds from Blue, but a lot of pressure on that med, taking damage from that Pyro. And it looks like this is going to be another round, even up now. Even Z's, and it is 2-2. Two -two. Nice... Nice job there by John Madden. Absolutely, I did not even notice that quick fix. Jeez, 
Uh, he kind of interrupt me when I talk. But, um, I am gonna be watching. I'm gonna hit up some soldier action this mid. I will be watching the John Madden soldier pull lovely. He is whipping his team out to mid. Kind of disappointed we haven't seen some super fast roamer rollouts. But, uh, you know, with that boost from the whip, he's gonna be doing some work. He already jumps to his pack on IT. Looks like he's gonna be reloading some rockets, trying to scope out the med. He sees the med. He's gonna go for the bomb. No, Battle Bolt is right there with his minigun sort of denying so, sort of action going on there. Looks like Rolls-Royce, however, will get the stab onto Battle Bull, leaving Polovely a nice avenue. He gets a few rockets, some splash off on the medic, but his team will cap mid. So, um, yeah, both medics still up. Some pretty decent picks. Cole coming in, trying to get something happen. Rockets on. Oh, gets taken down by the crossbow. Drake absolutely denying that. Maybe it would have been better to have that extra rocket in Cole's case as opposed to having the black box, but who yeah. knows? No, those those crossbow kills are so satisfying <laughs> as a medic player. Most definitely. We are having some aggression in the form of ODB moving in here, and it looks like Vanilla Love will be taking some, you know, ground over here as well. They don't necessarily need to pop off an Uber to take second call over here. Trying to bomb in again. Therafer getting a really nice snipe onto Mel. That was a drop. Ooh, that just guaranteed his team a push into last at least. Super awesome play from him. Good job. This could very well be the round, actually, as a lot of picks have come through with John Madden, and we're gonna see the immediate push in here as Red Uber comes off. A lot of pressure. This NG is getting launched in the air, gets air shot. Uh, a lot of bodies on point, and wow, another round that quick for John Madden. They're already up. Came down from that 2 0 epic, uh, deficit <clears throat> and got three quick wins. Wow, talk about momentum. Phew. So that will be a... Go hey, ahead, what? take this mid, friend. Oh, I'm gonna watch Bronze on this mid. Change of class. Um, <clears throat> takes the stars out by taking out that sticky. Uh, putting pressure on that other scout. He's got that buff from his pretty boy fog pistol. He's gonna back up here and he gets immediately killed by Palovely. DCSY takes out Evan and... Flossy Major getting out a lot of nice damage with his sticks. Cole with the bomb takes out Zukuma, finally not getting air blasted in the face and dying. Evan takes down Rolls Royce, the spy battle there. And this is gonna be a mid for Squirtle Squad. Change of plans. Oh man, super good pick there by, um, I believe it was, yeah. He popped, taking down ODB with a headshot as soon as he got to mid. So that was definitely a huge play for his team. Not having that demo out on mid to put out that damage is definitely going to be great. As well as Drake going down. Malon is going to have Uber, and he pops it right away to avoid a sticky trap. He pops on his demo, but where is the remaining team? It looks like Farafer gets caught out by a sticky there. And instead, it looks like this demo is going to meet a Pyro in the form of Zukima in rollout. So they're just going to have to contend themselves with catching second. Oh my god, Rolls Royce decloaks right on the point and kills. Oh, the police. What a stab. <laughs> what a stab. There were at least seven people on that point, and that guarantees the fact. Oh, Cole jumping in behind, trying to get Back the cap on. Oh, oh, he gets no. killed again by Drake's crossbow. But it doesn't matter. They were going to have some Uber to defend point, but it doesn't matter because there were only three people up, two people up on John Madden. That is going to be 3-3. Three, three. Wow, these are going fast. Yeah, a lot faster than I'm used to in my Highlander experience. But this is super close right now. Who are you going to watch on mid? I think I'm going to watch the opposing team scout aliasing as he was number one. And he's using the soda popper, so I'm going to be excited to see what's going to be happening there. Avoids some stickies over here, takes an aggressive stance on crates already. Trying to catch out that spy, sees if he gets denied by that mini sentry. Just sort of peeking around here, trying to put out as much damage as he can. I have heard talk about Zapopper potentially being taken out, and he does get a nice pick on the opposing team's demo. Philosophy Major goes down, gets some good damage off of Battle Bowl, decides to back up with his medic, but uh, just a good amount of pressure and getting his team, you know, that mid cap. So, yeah. Yeah, taking out Battle Bowl was a pretty key pick there, and. <clears throat> Yeah, the Soda Popper is also an interesting weapon that recently got the update and a change. Uh, but now an immediate push into second, and it looks like John Madden is already going to have second pretty soon as the Pyro's capping it off and they're rushing in. Absolutely, with Mallet down. Oh my god! Where did the medics go? He had full Uber and just absolutely gone. 
what is going on here? Battle Bull picking a nice pick there. Heap Hop getting a pick onto Pharaoh after, and it looks like Squirtle Squad will be able to defend this point after all. What even happened there, Zumu? I don't even know. <laughs> the stalemate. Three, wow. three. Uh, does that mean they play another round? Looks like the server's changing levels. We ran out of map time on process of all maps. I guess, will they move into Golden Cat on this map, or will they move straight to Viaduct? I'm not sure. I think it'd have to be Golden Cap. That seems, yeah, Golden Cap it looks like here. So, I see why they're rushing in so quickly, as they really needed to try to get that win quickly. But it looks like they're going to be forced into a Golden Cap, because they couldn't pull off that win fast enough, and Squirrel Squad hangs on there. All right, so I guess first to last wins as we're kind of waiting on the server to change maps, getting people in here, and uh, I'm sitting on the edge of my seat. I'm waiting for John Madden to bring it back because they were playing very poorly on the first map, Viaduct, on Monday, so it's really nice to be seeing some momentum going in here, seeing some points capped, and seeing some nice plays going on. Man. All right, who do you think the MVP was of that half? <laughs> so much going on. Hmm. You know, <clears throat> I really liked Rolls Royce's picks. I was really impressed he got that really nice med pick. That was pretty awesome. Most definitely. That deep cloak was absolutely ridiculous. There must have been five people on the point. He was just over there by the barrier. Just cool as a cucumber. Stabs him in the back. Nuts. I like that phrase. I'll use that now or something. <laughs> <laughs> Go for it. And um, I was definitely having fun watching Zukima just absolutely deny Cole as much as he was trying to jump in, even getting that reflect rocket air shot. Call me a little bit biased, but that was pretty awesome. So. You don't play Pyro, do you? No. <laughs> no, why, why would I play Pyro? Nobody plays Pyro. Nobody likes Pyro mains. Who am I kidding? Stuff like that is so awesome to watch and see. So we are getting people in the server. We do have everyone up in here. And we are just waiting for the ready up and waiting for stuff to start. There we are. Man, so here's the big question. Who do you think is going to take take it? Take it as a yes. win, you mean? Ah, take it. Oh, yes. okay. Well, <laughs> I'm kind of thinking that John Madden is going to take it. Even though Squirrel Squad did win the last round, John Madden was really commanding there towards the end, and they almost had Squirrel Squad there at the end, but they kind of ran out of time. I don't know. We're going to see if there's maybe a little huddle or conference Squirrel Squad can kind of get their act together as they were letting John Madden come back on them in that last mm -hmm. round before we ran out of time. Unless Absolutely. something changes radically, I see John Madden taking this golden cap round. Uh, hey, we might see some next level strats coming off here, especially with having that sort of half going on and just uh, waiting to see what will happen. You know, it's always good to sit back with your team, maybe try something completely off the wall, or maybe try something that works. And there's definitely something to be said of momentum. With, you know, letting John Madden get that one round off, it brought it back to a 3-3, where it was originally a 2-0 in favor of Squirtle Squad. So that is definitely something I like to see. I like to see the comebacks. I like to see the back and forth. Maybe a little bit back and forth internally on the map in, you know, Highlander versus 6 6 yeah. But process is just fun to play and what my opinion at least so i guess john madden are the comeback kids and a very good football coach or something all right so we do have all 18 players in the server just sort of gonna wait around for that maybe i can try and find some logs while we wait see if i'll hunt those up yeah, let's see here if we got any interesting pregame frags or something. I don't know. <laughs> Who do you think is going to be the standout player in this golden cap? Ooh, I am going to have to say Heap Hop has been 
just getting some really nice picks to all this game. So I'm definitely going to be interested in seeing what he's going to be doing. And, you know, Fairoffers have been getting some really nice headshots as well. So I'm going to be watching the snipers, this golden cap. Because, uh, you know, instant kill from that far away, definitely something to be yeah. said for the usefulness Good of that. Good choice. Are we sure that he pop is not Zig in disguise or something? No, he's not. Okay, so a completely different person. Uh, huh? I'm pretty sure it is. Because as we know, it's not unlike Zig to Alias. Mm hmm Alright, I have not been able to find the stats quite yet. I am trolling through the logs page, haven't really found them. Who knows, maybe maybe somebody can find them. Ah, I did see the post over there, thank you very much. I believe Takram for posting that in chat. That is 3-3 three, three and um, in damage, I'm just going to take a look at that. Ignoring the uh, sniper pick, the sniper factor in damage, ODB hitting it up with 343 DPM. Nice. Have we started? Are we going? Oh man, we are going. What am I doing talking about stats? We have stuff going on. All right. We already have some aggressive jumping going over here from Cole, and it looks like we're going to have that aggressive sentry placement once more from, I believe, Game... No, not Game Master, the other team's NG. We sort of have a frantic fight going on here. We don't have any peaky heavy plays, and it looks like he was number one, gets taken down. Hip Hop gets a nice pick on there. ODB stickies up Cole, and ODB gets stickied up himself from Philosophy Major, and we are going to be taking some... Uh, you know, ground here, Squirtle Squad getting that first cap of the golden cap. They are on mid here and they are ready to go. Both medics did make it out alive though. And we are 100% Ubers on both sides and they're going to be rolling straight into second. Yeah, um, <clears throat> Mela and Drake both did survive here. So uh, pushing in the second is not going to be easy, certainly. But here is the red Uber comes out, uh, blue Uber response, Uber is exchanged, and blue's gonna get a little better, and red's gonna go back and see if they can cut this Uber, as <clears throat> blue kind of using that Uber as a scare tactic. Lovely takes down Evan, uh, Bomb comes in here from Cole, uh, backs out, uh, he's hiding in that corner, he only has 22 HP, takes down the best fun in the game, but then gets sniped by Rolls, Rolls Royce with the Ambassador. Really nice going on there. Battle Bull being a little bit aggressive. He managed to make it out alive through sewers, sort of playing ring around the rosy as uh, Rolls Royce was hopping up on that crate, decided to snipe all the way across point. Farah for getting a pretty nice sight line here, and that was a really nice defense. And, uh, you know, it was a good push initially, but it just didn't work out. We have Vanilla Love playing a little bit of a flank heavy over here, watching the upstairs area and watching IT. It's always nice to see a more, uh, demo pyro oriented team as that has been the meta as opposed to the more you know heavily pocketed he heavily pocketed class that heavy used to be and we do have mallet coming out with the uber they give them 10 percent, not really enough to move in on however and uh we're just playing the waiting game we have a little bit of aggression coming out here over the blue scout and uh we'll just see who makes the first mistake we'll see who gets more impatient first and uh yeah Whew, second yeah, I guess, well, Squirrel Squad did win that initial mid, and my prediction is not looking that good, although nothing's set in stone yet. Um, <clears throat> I guess defying a Squirrel Squad prediction that initially uh, went well is not a good idea. Uh, it looks like, well, I'm not sure he's going to make the first move here. Just a lot of spam coming through from Cole, but he has to get some health back now. Yeah, Evan got a really nice pick on Farah for pulling out that revolver and making sure he went down. Rolls Royce goes down to a flare from DJ. I don't believe, no, he is DRing, so that is definitely happening right now. And we are having a scout kind of moving in here, demo moving in, cold jumping in, trying to get something happen, but he gets taken down by a combination of pyro, air blasting, and mini sentry. So we are going to be moving in here through choke, getting a little aggressive, and we have a red set up here on mid, taking a little bit of a more passive hold and ready to back out. They don't want to have their medic go down with full uber, especially with that sort of disadvantage going on. 
Bronze over here jumping around trying to get some stuff down. Rolls Royce gets caught out and the blue Uber does finally get popped. Drake goes down to 73 health before finally popping out that Uber. He decides to Uber his soldier in. He jumps and he meets up back with his heavy in IT. And we do have the red Uber got forced super nice play there by the lovely the blue soldier and forcing that uber making sure that they have enough time to reset maybe get some uber maybe defend the second point once more really nice exchange and so cole's gonna try and bomb in there and absolutely decimates that scout so he's gonna be having some free reign over there on second and it looks like oh, oh. the snipe he popped taking down drake with the super nice headshot oh that's gonna be at least a 60 percent advantage kill on Rolls Royce. <laughs> It just keeps happening, and it looks like Squirtle Squad will be trying to push in as soon as they possibly can. Maybe. <laughs> yeah, they Crazy just need about 31% there. before they're going to have their Uber. Absolutely. And that was an amazing pick, yeah. Uh, it's kind yeah. of do or die here. Uh, Blue needs to get a pick on the other team's med, mm -hmm. or they're going to be in for rough uh, situations. <laughs> Yeah, and especially with the heavy and medic down for John Madden, there's not going to be much that they're going to be able to do. We do have the red over being popped out onto that demo, onto that pyre, cleaning up Zukima, cleaning up Lovely, cleaning up Rolls Royce, and we're just going to have people on the cap. Rolls Royce decloaking behind the medic there gets decimated by some stickies, and that would be the golden cap going to Squirtle Squad. What a match! Wow, that was super Ooh. close. Are we still going? Are, are we still going? Nah, we're not. That is that is it. That is GG for this point. And because it is Squirtle Squad who won on Viaduct and Squirtle Squad who won on... Oh, sorry, CP Process. We will be going to a second best of three, correct me if I'm wrong? Yes, we are, yeah. Interesting there, we have that lobby push yet again being quite popular here in this game. Um, worked pretty well, they had that full uber advantage, so kind of a cakewalk there at the end with no defensive uber to go up against. Wow. Um, I'm still looking at some logs from first half. Uh, we were right in looking at those snipers, Hip-Hop and Farah were leading in terms of frags. I'm not looking at second half or that one round stat quite yet. I believe they don't get uploaded until the server unexecs. So we will be, I guess, waiting for the map choices and waiting for stuff to be happening. Um, yeah, so I say let's take a quick break between maps and stuff like that, and let's cut to music and then go from there. Alright, sounds like a plan.
I want I wanted to know what the map is. Alright, so we are live once more. We are waiting on one person to get onto the team, and we are back on Viaduct. We've been seeing a lot of viaducts. And um I'm excited. Are you excited? I'm so excited. I am super excited. Viaduct, as I have expressed before, is one of my favorite maps, and you know what they say. All roads lead to Viaduct. Uh <laughs> Okay, I'll I'll believe you. I'll believe you this one time, but you're the first person I've heard say that, so I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. So here we are, back once more on Viaduct, and I am gonna I'm gonna give John Madsen some credit here. They did beat Squirtle Squad two times on Koth maps during the regular season, but we do have some crazy snipes coming out here, and Sniper is a pretty dominant class on Viaduct, so we'll see what goes on. What do you think, Zumo? <clears throat> well, I'm gonna agree with you. You know, I I predicted John Madden would, you know, force a game three on the first set. They didn't, but as you said in the regular season, they did really well against Squirrel Squad on cough maps. Um, <clears throat> I mean, maybe I'd say their sniper has performed a little bit worse than Squirrel Squad sniper, but. I think there's a reason they chose Viaduct as their map choice. Mm -hmm. And I feel like their first loss on Viaduct was kind of a fluke, and this is, I think, by no stretch of the imagination, gonna be a blowout of any measure. Mm -hmm. I'm definitely gonna be interested to see the choices that our medics make, Drake and Mallant, whether they're gonna be sticking to Uber like they did on process and on the previous Viaduct map, or if we're gonna see some crits coming out here onto ODB or onto Mr. Philosophy Major over here. So, uh, yeah, definitely interested to see some close quarters play and especially our spies. I know a lot of spies love Viaduct, lots of stuff to jump off of, lots of uh, room to be extremely annoying, which is what spies do best. So Rolls Royce and Evan gonna be making some big plays hopefully here. Yeah, I do like Rolls Royce, as in the cars. <laughs> Alright, so we are just waiting on teams to ready up. Um, they do have the go from Mr. Mambole over there in chat, and so we're, we're just gonna wait on the rups, we're gonna wait on the F4s, and I already heard one do it, and we're gonna be going live soon. It's happening. It's happening. Yes, it is. I don't know why we're <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you hit up this first mid. Alright, I'm gonna watch Philosophy Major on mid. Gets- oh, beats his demo adversary to mid, gets some nice pipes there on the other demo. Uh, Bronze coming out here, full steam. Uh, Ferrofer gets a nice snipe, winning that sniper duel. Snipe on Hipop. Zukuma gets another! Reflects, kills Evan. Philosophy Major takes down that mini. Rolls Royce snipe on Philosophy Major, and Zukuma another reflect. DJ finishing off Rolls Royce and a lot of damage coming out here as this looks to be a mid for <clears throat> excuse me. Looks to be a mid for John Man. Wow, Evan kind of getting smoked there by that reflect pipe, but it doesn't matter because he managed to pistol down ODB in the process, and he's going to be a extremely late pick. So good job on the spy right there. We are having a fairly passive hole with Vanilla of the Heavy and his medics sort of over on their cliff as opposed to the opposing cliff. We don't see too much action, too much aggression going on here quite yet. Rolls Royce is behind the entire team. Maybe he'll get a good pick. I see him. He's on Invis Watch. I believe, yes he is, and he's gonna be moving in on that combo a little bit, he sees him, no, he also gets caught out, gets hit with a really nice thing. Pharah for getting that headshot on bronze though, nice, and we do have a little bit of contesting over here, <laughs> Evan sort of decloaking behind that rock, getting a little time on, Cole jumping all the way behind, still running that black box, he's jumping around, DJ taking people down, and the red uber does get forced out. And they're gonna have to retreat, and the blue uber comes in, the jumping coming over here by Philosophy Major, and that is going to be a really nice definitive cap from Squirtle Squad. However, that was a really nice hold, and we're gonna see ODB here, actually, interestingly, using that loose cannon, so... A oh, he gets taken out there by... Wow. Okay. There's a repush. I believe, is that, is that the Natasha coming out from Vanilla Love over here? Is that what's going on, or am I going crazy? I think you are quite sane. 
<laughs> oh wow. Uh, I forgot that the, 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 the Natasha wasn't banned in UGC. However, that was going to be a bit of a failed repush as Vanilla Love does go down, so does Pelovely, so does Zukima, and Drake manages to escape with 75% Uber. He's going to be healing people, and that is going to be a recap for Squirtle Squad. We have Bronze getting aggressive over here. And oh, ODB! Gets destroyed by that loose cannon from ODB. And so that is going to be a pretty nice pick going on here as both medics are approaching 100% Uber. We do have people jumping around, people here and there, a little bit of aggression over here. The lovely playing that concrete pretty nicely. We do have the aggressive sniper coming out here. He pop getting pocketed, trying to get a snipe on para after. Evan gets caught out. Cole takes down Pa lovely and Zukima hits up that soldier pick once more. Oh, Rolls Royce gets a nice stab on bronze and ODB kicks down Ballad. I think that was a drop. Oh man, and that is gonna be a really nice cap for John Madden as well. That loose cannon, friend, is yeah. pretty nasty. That, that weapon's seen a lot of play recently. It's oh, seen absolutely. a lot of play recently. Um, it technically got a buff as there was a bug with it uh, relating to double donks, and it got fixed. So it does more damage now, I think. Mm -hmm. So wow. it's certainly a, a demo weapon of a, a new flavor. <laughs> Fair effort taking taking down DJ and Bronze taking down Rolls Royce. Flossy Major uh, using those loose cannon bombs. Would you say cannonballs instead? Oh, double donk that scout. Philosophy Major taking that in. I'm telling you, that crit loose cannon shot plus the knockback is nothing to sneeze at. We have both heavies holding up here on Cliff, trying to stay out of sight lines. And uh, we do have a lot of, bit of stuff going on here. Fair effort takes down DJ. So that's going to be a pretty nice snipe coming in from here. And we're just we're just waiting. We're getting a little bit of aggression over here from ODB. He might get caught out. Hopefully he doesn't get double donk. He does not. He does make it out. Both medics are approaching once more. 100% Uber Rolls Royce ambassadors he popped down. So it looks like people are free to peek once more. Throwing loose cannon shot all over here. Battle Bull takes down Rolls Royce. He gets caught out. And Pharaoh also gets bonked. And we do have the Uber. Finally, the blue Uber comes out from Squirtle Squad. The red Uber as well as that blue pirate is going to do a nice job of denying but it looks like they aren't going to be able to take that point. And we do have Heaven over here on the medic. He is disguised. He manages to make it out without too much suspicion. And we have a last ditch push over here from Squirtle Squad getting on the point and they do get the cap. All yeah. John Madden needs to do is cap. That's all they have to do. Yeah, they really won that Uber and post for an engagement. However, it's going to be tough for them to hold this for that long. Oh, by the way, uh, Philosophy Major is actually Sneaky Polar Bear. I think I called him out wrongly as playing Soldier earlier. He is actually on the demo man and Cole is on Soldier instead. Sorry if there's any confusion. Polovely jumping behind. They're trying to take that cap over here. John Madden over here. Looks like Vanilla Love's trying to be uh, <laughs> fisting, steel fisting people on the point. It isn't quite working out. And Drake drops down to 52 health. He has 60% Uber. And it looks like Mallet is going to have that 100% Uber advantage. They're going to try and hold on to it as long as they possibly can. They have 60 seconds left to hold on to this. And we do have the spot coming out. He forces the Uber. Super nice play. You drop down off the cliff. Force that Uber out. They're going to have to just make do as they can and John Madden does have that uber as well they pop it on ODB and their scout they're going to be moving forward as well all they need to do is cap the point all they need to do is get men on that point and people are just furiously trying to contest viaduct is as it always is a crazy meat locker bronze goes behind takes down Drake and that is the cap though for John Madden wow John Madden certainly are no they're no slouch or whatever as a team I was mm -hmm. football coach. I'm gonna watch. I guess Switcher on this mid. Uh, <clears throat> already reflecting some cannonballs. Oh, nice! Uh, Evan gets taken down by ODB's cannonball. And Heepop gets a snipe on the best fun in this game. Battle Bull's up on that cliff trying to get some damage below him. Checking for spies, trying to protect his mid. Heepop takes out the other demo, ODB. And that's gonna be a big pick here in this mid. Oh, man. Evan is behind, he's in position, he DR actually across the point, so he's gonna take down I Love Anime, that scout over there, who has since changed aliases, and we do have some pretty significant just positioning over here, oh the big bomb in by Cole, trying to take down that medic, he does finally get a second rocket onto Drake, looks like Zukiba wasn't gonna get that air shot today. And that is going to be a nice cap, clean cap from Squirrel Squad. We do have a little bit of 
counter contesting here, but the Uber does get popped off as ODB jumped in really aggressively, trying to get it down. Bronze takes him down. Farafford does take down Battle Bowl, however. So that is a heavy drop, but it doesn't matter because he has Bronze and his demo Polar Bear to Uber. And uh, man, another nice snipe from Hip Hop onto the Red Heavy. And so that is an almost cap from Red Team, but yeah, a really good defense is, from Squirtle. Oh, Bronze has, uh, he gets taken out. He had a nice 3k there. Um, <clears throat> we saw the recap almost went through there for for red. Mm -hmm. But we're going to see now pretty equal Ubers as both of them got popped off and lovely taking down Hip Hop. Ooh, the backstab onto Drake once more. Evan doing some work on this map. He gets taken down by I Love Anime, but it doesn't quite matter because that Uber is absolutely gone to the wind. We have 78. We have lovely behind trying desperately to get a force off that medic Ferrar for sniping battle bowl however mallant does manage to stay up and we need to cap that point vanilla love is playing that natasha which is definitely something interesting um a lot of ammo and good for good against scouts good against bomber we do have a scout v scout going down there he gets taken out fairly easily and we are gonna have that half going in from squirrel squad yeah not a bad hold there um we're gonna see Squirrel Squad has a pretty nice advantage as it's gonna take a while for for Red to build up their Uber. Um, <clears throat> uh, yeah, Hip Hop takes down the mini and Evan pistols down Pharaoh Rapper. I love Anime takes down Evan in exchange. Um, oh, Battle Bowl on the cliff there, putting some pressure on the opposing demo. And ooh, wow, Dom. And then it's happened that uh, a nice end snipe taking down an angry officer he pop putting in their rolls royce taking down cold and we do have mallet sitting over here with 100 uber the uber finally gets popped off there's some stickies going in there he ubers in on bronze and the counter uber comes out from his red counterpart as well they're going to be trying to push in off that point trying to make it happen rolls royce gets caught out by that demo and looks like that natasha is going to be taking down evan as well not many people jumping in quite yet and it looks like john madden is going to be able to take this point and there isn't going to be much of a repush quite yet both medics managed to make it out alive and we are just having a lot of really sort of passive holds over here nobody's really playing the point nobody's standing on the point unless they absolutely have to if they have to cap it is as i said quite a bit of a meat grinder and that's what i love about viaduct you have to have make that action happen in order to win the penetration shot Oh, after using the Makina, gets the pick on Malin with freaking penetration shot. Oh my god. Video game, that was super cool. Super wow. cool, wow. Nice job there by Feral Raffer. That Man. is a nice momentum swing, certainly. Feral Raffer has two nominations right now. Right, and we are having a pretty, pretty even time here on both sides, on both teams. Both teams are about one minute left on the clock, getting some rockets out. We do have some stickies being thrown out here, trying to, you know, get some stuff off. Philosophy Major, that is Polar Bear, being sniped by Farrafer once more. Bronze being taken down as well. Somebody put this kid out. He is on fire. And we are getting, finally, Hip Hop gets a snipe on vanilla love the heavy so that might be enough to maybe try and contest it but it doesn't matter drake is at 40 health and has 100 percent uber and they will have more than enough to defend this point with unless somebody gets really aggressive on that meta and it looks like those loose cannon shots are going to be flying in bronze peaking a little bit on that point and we have Malant approaching 100% Uber, so somebody's gonna have to make up their mind and push as we have 34 seconds left on the clock as John Madden wins. Drake is still at 100%. Nobody's been behind him yet. Bronze gets caught out, and the Uber finally does get popped onto the Red Heavy, the counter Uber as well. I believe as soon as he got it, however, that pyro denial is happening very nicely um, with that flash. He finally gets taken down, DJ gets taken down, and they're going to recap that point. Squirtle Squad did get it. Oh, sick sticky kill onto Vanilla of the Heavy over there. And we just need to cap the point. We still have less than one minute on both sides. Wow. Yeah, wow. Um, they're going to need to go in for the recap pretty soon here. As the clock is ticking down almost, well, let's see, 10 seconds here before the mission ends, as she says. Um, <clears throat> no Uber to go off of. Desperation here. 
the jumps in Soldier and Depo jumping in on the point, people flying all over the place, and it doesn't matter if that round goes to John Madden. Woo! Yeah, 2 0 John Madden, and I'm gonna watch, um, let's see. Let's watch the red demo here on Med ODB. Going for a pretty aggressive roll out there on top of that rock. Sticky spamming, and now coming out with those uh, <clears throat> cannonballs. I love anime taking out Evan. Not many fires coming out yet, but ODB got taken out, and so that's going to be an advantage for Squirrel Squad to help aid them with this mid. Game Master. Oh, wow. Super early snipe there on ODB by He Pop, so that was really good. Pyro, the Pyro Zukim was trying to cap over there, finally gets pistoled down by Evan. He was very low, and that is going to be an almost wipe from John Madden, leaving only Drake alive. Good on him to get out there with that 75% Uber, but his counterpart does have 100%, but he is up with his demo, and they do have spawn advantage, so they can just toss people in here until they can get the pick or the force that they need, and Drake does have Uber as of now. Yeah, that was pretty close there for Drake as Mambale says in chats. <clears throat> well, I was, we're gonna see the repush here from Red with their Uber that they held on to. And oh, oh, Drake dropped that trap! Oh my god, that's sticky! Uh, the Uber comes up from Blue Side, Polar Bear taking it as well as DJ and the Uber. They don't really find anyone with it except for Zukima who gets the dong. And Bronze is gonna walk on that point take down his opposing scout and that is going to stay blue tonight yes it is that, that's a rough spot there for drake um <clears throat> drops are tough to recover from they're really frustrating the best fun in this game uh shotguns down evan <clears throat> uh we have pretty equal ubers here um as the dropped uber gets exchanged for the popped uber absolutely and you know having those even uber it was maybe it would have been in uh, Malin's favor to just sort of hold on to that as much as possible. We do have people trying to get on that point and cap, and not much pressure being put on that as they do manage to get the cap before backing off. ODB gets taken down by a nice sticky from Polar Bear, aliasing as Philosophy Major. But Lovely takes down Cole, and uh, Heaven does get caught out as well. Uh, talk about spy action. Ooh, the big bomb in here from Pull Lovely. He doesn't manage to pick up anyone, and he dies to Afterburn. Or was that a snipe? Yes, it was. He popped picking him up with a really nice body shot over here. Both medics are still hitting up 100% Battle Bolt. Gets sniped by Ferrafer. And so that'll definitely delay any sort of push that they might be wanting to have as ODB is throwing out some really aggressive stakies miles ahead of his team. But it doesn't matter. Nobody can walk into that loose cannon range. Yeah. Uh, as Cool takes our Rolls Royce here and... We're going to see a repush potentially soon with the equal ubers here. But time yeah. is time is ticking down. Um, tough spot here for John Madden to come back from as Squirrel Squad is now recapping pretty soon. Bronze takes out the lead and uh, ODB takes down Game Master. Blossomy Major getting the cannonball on Isle of Anime and Zutramo with the melee kill on Evan. Interesting. Alright, you see aggression coming out. Both Ubers have been popped already. We do have people capping the point. ODB takes down Mallet with that nice cannonball throwing in there. So John Madden really just needs to play their heal, play it cool, try not to get picked. Ferrafer takes down Battle Bowl once more. He's playing maybe a bit more aggressively than he should, especially on such a sniper dominated map. Oh, nice headshot onto Evan. Ferrafer is just going absolutely nuts. Takes down Heap Hop as well. That is a nice 3k on his Machina right now. All right, here you go. Sneaky jumping in, gets sniped once more. Jesus, Ferrafer, you're going nuts. Rolls Royce gets a backstab on Game Master the NG, and the clock is ticking down. 130 left on this. We do have Evan playing a little bit more aggressively, DRing across that point. Maybe he'll be able to get a pick. Man. Yeah, uh, interesting here as. Drake oh, goes down. Oh my god. Oh, Mallet goes down too. These snipers are insane. Down. What is even going on? We don't need medics to play video games, say these snipers. Ferrafer finally gets taken down by a headshot. Evan being aggressive on that point once more. Looks like we didn't even need Uber to push across this point. We don't even need all the double kill on point with that double dunk by ODB. It looks like Drake is going to be throwing some crossbows across. Oh, it's taken down again by the loose cannon. 
Somebody stop these people! Uh, 60 seconds left, less than 60 seconds left on both clocks for both teams, and it looks like John Madden will finally get this cap. Wow! Finally, it's gonna be a rough spot here for Squirrel Squad. They really need to win this round, actually, or I think that will be the map as we're only playing halves. Right. All right, we get it in. Cole doing some jumping over here, throwing some rockets upon point. Keep hop taking down Pull Lovely. I'm not seeing quite much more happening. Trying to get some aggression of their sneaky, getting his stuff reflected by Zukima the Pyro over there. Loose cannon's pretty hard to reflect, but they're flooding onto that point. They need to take it as soon as they can, and we do have medic over launched here. into the air so oh. high. Wow. <laughs> The Hoover does get popped out. People are jumping cliff, trying to make stuff happen. Zukima gets taken down by backstab from Evan. Cole goes down <laughs> from by Lex, and uh, both medics still manage to make it out alive. I don't know how, and we are looking at a recap from John Madden. Despite the sticky, it looks like they're going to be trying to push back in as much as possible. They know that stuff is down to the wire right now. Uh, people sort of jumping all over the place. Lovely gets taken down by a really nice air flare, so good on him, and John Madden finally caps the point once more, 15 seconds on the clock. Yeah, um, <clears throat> Blue won't have, have the time enough to build up an uber, but Red will have a quick defensive uber, which they're going to be able to use, use and employ to try to stop Blue here, but a lot of eyes coming on cap here. Red defense uber comes out, and finally, actually, they didn't have time for that uber. Blue's gonna have a little better uber. A lot of frags coming out here. Bronze takes them. Wow, oh, this looks like they're gonna get this recap in overtime. Wow, this is a crazy, crazy grand final for heaven right here. Um, oh, Squirrel Squad battling for their life on this map right now, and they do get that recap really close there. Um, Cole got some nice frags. Um, they only need to hang on for a little bit, and, uh... <clears throat> We're gonna need to see an immediate replay. The conch here play John coming out here, pushing that out, giving his team the health. Oh, the big bomb in, trying to get something in for Lovely, trying to get that last point, and there it goes finally around his portal spot. Yowza. Yowza is right. <laughs> Alright, I am gonna manage to take a mid this time. I think I'm gonna be watching Lex, the John Madden scout. We're gonna be seeing how he's. Gonna do- oh my god, ODB just gets wasted by a double donk right away. Sneaky, putting it out there. Looks like Evan's gonna DR across the point, getting taken out- well, feigning from that soda popper. Uh, Lex is Bell gonna- Bell takes down Bailey, oh! the med pick already coming out, and Cole takes down Polovely. Polovely takes down Cole, they trade there. Evan takes down Farrafer. Um, not sure who's gonna win this mid, pretty equal frags, a uh, couple in favor of Squirrel Squad. Um, Mm, they're gonna get this mid, I think, as Red kinda has to back up and Heavy's gonna eat a sandwich. No, no, he's gonna toss it. Um, yeah, DCSY taking down Game Master, DCSY Ooh. taking down DJ. The Uber gets taken out, but it doesn't matter. Drake goes down to a nice bomb over there from Cole. Hip Hop takes down Zukima, and that is gonna be the entire John Madden combo cleaned up. Demo, Heavy, Pyro, and Medic. However, they do have spawns, and we do have traps over here, as we do have that aggressive sort of sneaky trying to trying to keep his team a little bit more, you know, alive. Yeah, that was just like Oxy Clean. <laughs> Mr. Cleaning it up. All right, we do have some rockets being shot across point. Looks like Rolls Royce is also going to be DRing across point, trying to make stuff happen. He pop takes down that engineer, and we are setting up in the usual places. We have Ferrofer being taken down. Looks like Evan is going to be pressuring that sniper after he did ab went absolutely huge that last bit. He's going to be in position. Evan maybe in point. He's getting healed by the medic. Ah, oh, he manages to make it out. I believe he manages to DR once more. So both medics are approaching 100% with Drake at 80 and Mallet at 100, getting some reflex in here. Evan just being a pain in the butt, and Heap Hop getting a nice snipe onto ODB. So that is going to delay any sort of push right now, and just loose cannons flying all over the place. Wow, what a game! Yeah. Oh wow! The lovely headshot, Heap Hop, killing him. Rolls Royce getting a back style on Game Master. Just trading people all over the place. It looks like somebody is gonna have to own up and push because the longer you wait, the more that clock just ticks, ticks, ticks down. Ubers are exchanged here as the pyro plays are working pretty well for Red right now, and um, they really need to recap this point soon, but they're being pushed right out, so not really that successful of an Uber there for them. 
Um, but no, they actually are going to be able to recap as uh, Blue does... Ooh, they got some frags there. And Hip Hop takes down DCSY. Um, Hip Hop's getting some really nice picks on that combo. <laughs> he got double dunk though! <laughs> nice! Wow. People just the all over cannon. the place. <laughs> the loose cannon is a weapon in this game, ladies and gentlemen, and crits are especially fair and balanced. We are having more time going on here. <laughs> wow, a nice reflector rocket onto the lovely who tried to bomb in. DJ said no thank you and hit him with a really nice rocket going on there. Pyro is doing some pretty nice work here as Malon is approaching Uber. Uh, Drake not far behind. By the way, Vanilla Love Red Heavy did switch off of Natasha. I guess that wasn't working out so well for him. And people just getting headshot right and left. And oh my god, Mallet goes down to Rolls Royce. I think that was a drop. Oh my god. Somebody take care of your medics, please. I know, right? Uh, <clears throat> Viaduct not being that friendly to the medics here as he just dropped it like it was hot or something, I don't know. Um, <laughs> Cole takes down I Love Anime. And we're gonna see the blue recap here as the frags are coming out for Squirrel Squad and this is what they need to get this recap. Oh, but then the red Uber comes out and they're gonna block that recap. Mm -hmm. uh, but they need to retreat as they are down in men and um, aggressive plays on the med of red here as ODB. Oh, oh, he got headshot oh my god he pop getting a ridiculous sightline headshotting that medic just as evan and the demo were bearing down on him so it looks like this is going to be a blue point of course spawns are going to be in red's favor once more as the red heavy is going to eat a sandwich and get back into the action right here we are not looks it looks like we're not going to let that clock tick down far too much as we are seeing a little bit of more forward hold on red here but Malin is approaching 100% uber so hopefully oh my god here comes ODB bombing in trying to get something happen Heaven gets headshot and Malin gets taken down by some nice stickies that huge bomb going in I love it when demos jump and it looks like we're gonna maybe get the cap <laughs> Drake is on fire and he manages to stay alive with only three players up for him to heal wowzers yeah, I didn't realize that medics could live for more than 10 seconds. <laughs> really, though? It's pretty insane. Alright, Sneaky after getting gets the nice down. snipe. Yeah. Right, we're just gonna wait. Um, let's see if they could hold this for a minute and 15 seconds. They might be able to. I'm getting a little bit of lag in here. Was that a pause? No, it's a pause. It's a pause. Alright. Looking at this, we're having a lot of drops and near drops. Six dying with 99% with 100%. Whoa, I wonder why we oh, paused. Oh, pause already. Oh, score. Uh, tense moment here for John Madden. They need to hold this for a little while. Um, Malin is going to have enough time to build up that Uber, but there is a defensive Uber here for Red. Um, my HUD is actually broken right now. No, okay, it's, ba it's back now. All right, Malin goes down to 20%, and then Heepaw picks up some snipes. So does Sneaky. He manages to snipe someone across the map with this loose cannon. Although, really, with this Uber, as Malin is approaching, he hasn't been taken down quite yet. All they really need to do is pop on the point, maybe block that cap, just because... Ah, uh, the Uber finally does get popped. Both Ubers on this point. People bumping into each other. Pyro is air blasting one another. It looks like Blue might have the better Uber as well as the better positioning as Yukima gets mowed down by that minigun. Absolutely awful. And Blue does get the cap. They have 13 seconds. They have to hold on to it. But Red is going to have those spawns. They're probably going to be jumping in sometime soon. ODB over here. Really aggressive. Bronze is on. He gets taken down by a combination of NG and Scout. And it's just people scrambling all over the place trying to get the cap. Trying to prevent people from off the cap. We are in overtime. There are zero seconds on the clock. Somebody's got to jump in. Get some time on. Rolls Royce decloaking and Heavy ran out of ammo, Battle gets backstabbed, and it wasn't enough time. Wow, 2-2. Two, two. This is so close. Wow, who are we gonna watch here on mid? Oh man, um, 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 let me just scroll through my little, uh, things here. I'm gonna watch Bronze. Bronze, 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 Bronze. Um, that was almost a team one. <laughs> He's gonna be over here, he gets freaking loose cannon right off the bat 39 health he's gonna be out of that fight ebony's deering across the point ng gets taken down already he popped dj 
getting lovely with that nice crit flare and Rolls Royce taking down Sneaky as well, which leaves Mallet with that uh with that Uber and he's gonna have a lot more people to pop on because Drake only has three people up on his team and that is going to be a really decisive cap over there for Squirtle Squad. Yeah, this is the deciding game right now. So big plays coming out now. Uh Brom takes on that dispenser. Big plays. <laughs> Dispenser took three! Dispenser took three! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Those are slightly important, and by slightly important, I mean not at all important comp, but it still happens. You gotta have your inside jokes. Both medics are 100% uber. Sneaky gets sniped once again. Farah for is dominating him, actually. And so, uh, we are gonna have quite a bit of an advantage moving in here, as it looks like John Madden's gonna be getting aggressive, but it looks like Mallet had to pop his uber off. So did Drake. We're having another uber v uber fight going on here, and it looks like, ah, uh, the Conjurer comes out giving the team that sort of health boost, but it doesn't really all that matter. People are down on both sides, and ooh, nice snipe over there. Heap Hop taking down Vanilla of the Red Heavy with some nice action going there. Crossbows sort of flying across the point, and the point remains red as well. Finally get some blue players on its cap. That we do. Um, <clears throat> we're going to see here pretty equal for uh, I love anime takes down Evan yet again, and... Now he's the arm. Oh, okay. I missed that. Oh man, so people just moved across, just mowing down that sniper, DJ just flaming down ODB, Cole taking down Zukima. these pyros are not having it today, both medics still have uber, Evan is behind enemy lines, he has eyes on the sniper, he's gonna just pistol him down, but his medic is there, Forever does go down to that revolver shot, and Evan is just gonna pester people, he's been playing a pretty aggressive gun spy all this time, and oh my god, Drake goes down to a really nice bomb by Cole too, which gives a huge advantage to Mallet. He has 100% uber, and they have a lot to defend with, so super nice play there. Yeah, that's, that's a big play. Um, exactly what Squirrel Squad needs. Most definitely, and I'm just I'm just looking at the doms on this. Uh, we have some crazy amount of dominations going on on both teams. Forever has four of them, Jesus Christ. Forever gets a snipe on Cole, and the uber did get forced out upon him by Mallet, and so he dropped down to about 50-ish health. Drake is going to be playing way back, playing it a little bit safe, and they're going to be using that uber defensively. And there's going to be a 20% advantage. I mean, not super significant, but hey, it's still an advantage, and they managed to get that window in, that window to push him. It'll really help. Yeah, especially to get a med pick in between, and also we see here, D DCSY takes down... Oh, Farah forgets to slam on Sneaky oh, Polar Bear. Oh, double dunk on Drake! Oh, just absolutely demolished. Sorry, go ahead. Oh, it's fine. Uh, Evan takes down Farrafer, and we see here, Bronze has three dominations. Uh, all right, recap, and but still, they're gonna have to hold this for a really long time, and we have to say here that certainly Squirrel Squad is in the advantageous position. Psst, psst, Drake is on quick fix. Oh man. And we're gonna be seeing some plays, and uh, it looks like they might get Uber just a little after Squirtle Squad gets theirs. His mount does get Uber right away. It looks like Evan is gonna be trying to do a little cheeky thing, tries to cap, just sort of DRs onto point, and the blue Uber does get popped out. No quick fix yet, so they're in on Bronze, trying to make stuff happen, but that air blast is absolutely nuts. Farafer gets headshot, I believe. Tsukima gets headshot as well. ODB takes down Battle Ball, and the quick fix gets popped out. Soldier jumps away, just flashing people all over the place, making sure those heals are on, and oh boy, are they on, and they manage to have that point. Squirtle Squad only needs to cap the point. They have a lot of time on it and hold it for 23 seconds. Yeah, and um, John Madden took a couple picks there, being a little too aggressive, trying to get the other teams mad, and they need to be careful here defensively as they, they can't give up this point uh, and be put in a situation where they need to recast super quickly. Oh, uh, we see the Conqueror coming out here to try to aid the blue push, and they're gonna get this recap, um, and they're gonna have an Uber to defend it, but we see an equal quick fix Uber on the other side. Oh, Uber does come out for blue, and they're trying to push the other team back. Uh, quick fix response here. Uh, heavy versus demo, they're blue's trying to kite this Uber, but also they can't give up. <laughs> oh, he just got out M1, Battle Bowl taking out Vanilla Lovey, even when he had quick fix popped on him. That extra health really does help, but it looks like John Madden's gonna be taking this point. But all Squirtle Squad needs to do is cap. 
all they have to do- Oh my god, is this a crits play? I think this is a crits play. I'm really excited. Mallet is on crits. It's gonna be crits versus quick fix. And uh, that'll definitely be something. I believe Soldier is still running the Conjurer. I saw him pop it off earlier. We do have Rolls Royce kind of in position to make a play over here. No doubt he's already called that Mallant is on that crit, so I'm excited. I want this to happen so badly. Crits, crits, yeah. Crits. I would say the crits kind of wins that engagement between quick fix and crits, because, oh, yeah. uh... Yeah, crits can still kill you because you don't get that invincibility that a regular uber would give oh, you. As Bronze They're takes ready. out Rolls Royce here, just getting eyes in the mid, the crits has popped out, and he goes in, sneaky polar bear taking down Farah after- <laughs> Oh my god, the crit stickies are all over the place, but he doesn't manage to get too much of the ODB takes taken down by Colt. Sneaky manages to stay up, both medics only are down right here. now, oh. only one up, it's only Rolls Royce, and that recap, Squirtle Squad 3-2 on Fyduck. Super close, wow. So many med picks. Super close, wow. That was amazing. <laughs> oh man. Um people going absolutely nuts. Let me see if I can find some logs for us to look at. Alright. As we are changing levels. Alright, I have the logs. Let me let me post them in here for Let's take a look. Get some nice stats going on. Top fragging, we have Farrafer with a big 49. Absolutely nuts. Um, also, top damaging, who has the best the DPM? It will be Sneaky Polar Bear, 477 DPM, uh, followed really closely by ODB with uh, 476. So definitely demos going huge and just Farrafer going absolutely nuts with that Machina. Wow. Crazy. And uh, next map, it looks like we are traveling. We are on our way to process once more. This is just, I don't know, it's just like a repeat. Hopefully, though, John Madden will be able to turn it around. It looks like they've been kind of neck to neck over here with the Squirtle Squad. And we'll see if they manage to pick up that momentum like maybe they did on the first process match. But, you know, take it home. Maybe we'll, we'll see a third matchup. Or third map matchup, pardon. That is what I'd like to see as the closer, the more dramatic, the better for the viewers. Most definitely. So we're just going to be uh, waiting around a little bit for players to get in server. And um, man, those stats just going absolutely nuts. Bronze also doing a super good job picking up the third amount of frags after both of the snipers and so he's definitely been on his a game today most definitely um yeah that that machina was so crazy the penetration kill though ah i love video games and i love tf2 because no game has quite the silliness and stupidity quotient of TF2, which means you can just get some huge, ridiculous plays, especially with those double dong, especially with those reflect, especially with the Maki backstabs. Just what a game! What gamer? It's, we do have people up in the server. We are getting ready for this to happen, and uh, man, I am excited. This has been a really fun matchup so far. Yeah, um, if you know. John Madden can hang on and push a third map here. We will see if they could win potentially and have that Viaduct be a third times the charm kind of game. Most definitely. Um, you know, I really want to see a turnaround from John Madden. They've been playing really well and they've definitely been playing much better as the night progresses. So I am looking forward to maybe, maybe going to that third map. Mm-hmm. Yeah, um... Who are you gonna be... The... Which med do you think is gonna die more often on this map? <laughs> um... I don't know. With our really aggressive flank on Squirtle Squad, I'm gonna say that 
Drake is probably going to find himself hitting up that respawn timer a little bit more than Malin, just because of those aggressive bombs that we already saw in process. And uh, Bronze trying to go in deep and go in huge. But, uh, you know, we'll see. You never know. You never know. Yeah. yeah. Um, personally, I'm looking to see uh, if Zuchima can get some... Uh, Zuchima, excuse me, can get some more nice reflex like he did last time on Cole, which Absolutely. is really amusing. Um, let me tell you, nothing quite beats a Highlander soldier comparing, uh, complaining after a match with a really good pyro. <laughs> um, I know Highlander can be quite a bit of a trial to play sometimes, just because of the, uh, the pyro factor. As, uh, some words that are oft-quoted, pyro is a class in this game. That is all. <laughs> Just like Air Blast is a mechanic. Um, but yeah, we do have people kind of sitting up in spec, I guess, taking a break, getting a drink of water, you know, do, doing, doing that thing. So, uh, yeah. I'm, I'm just, I'm, I'm hyped, man. I got my blood pumping off that viaduct, people going crazy, so I'm just ready for everyone to start going, you know? I totally get you. Alrighty. So, uh, who do you think is going to take the first mid? Um... Hmm... I'm looking to see that... Well... Yeah, let's say Squirtle Squad. That was... To be honest with you, even though they did win that last map... Um... I don't know, I feel like... And it wasn't overtime, I feel like it was actually a little bit more convincing that we kind of made it out to be, mm -hmm. so I think they have that, you know, edge in the mind game that will help them at least win the first mid, whether they can carry that out. Right. Most definitely. Um, I'm gonna be interested to see how these mids will have changed up. I know Battle Bowl was playing a really aggressive heavy, but, uh, the other team really adapted to that. John Madden decided to rotate around that, and he ended up being caught out quite a few times. Despite, you know, being that sort of jumper deterrent, so to speak. Those minis on the roofs were doing pretty nicely um, from that Red Engineer. So we'll just we'll just see what's going on as teams are sort of practicing DM. We have all nine people on each team once more. So uh, not to hype people up that we're going to go live soon, but you never know. I just heard the sound. Somebody f forward. It might be happening. Yeah, interesting here in this... In the entirety of these two sets, um, John Madden has not won a, a single match. Mm -hmm. So I kind of hope they do. It's always nice to have that underdog come out. Well, I mean, not necessarily the underdog, considering they're coming in from the upper bracket, but at least in this set of games, we might as well call them the underdog. They haven't really taken a single map, like you said, although... Admittedly, they've gotten pretty close. Mm -hmm. Just do, uh, I don't know. Who do you think is rocking the best outfit right now? <laughs> um, hmm. I'm not, not quite sure. I've been uh, looking around. I, I kind of dig that. Actually, no, I'm, I'm not digging that. Christmas tree hat at all, it vibrates quite unsettlingly. It makes me uncomfortable, know what I mean? It's the festive tree that ODB has been wearing all game. Uh, just kind of waiting around here. Let's actually... Are I mean, you they're really... or something? Do you not like Christmas trees? I hate Christmas, no fun allowed. <laughs> nah, I I'm just kidding. Okay, I'm not the Grinch. Alright, here we go. It looks like it's happening, it is happening. First mid is yours. Yeah, Cole is slapping the back of his teammates, and I'm gonna watch um, ODB here on mid <clears throat> change of pace. And ODB is the first to mid way faster than his demo adversary. Uh, getting some nice traps set up. Uh, pressure right now from Bronze. Um, oh, fair for a nice snipe already onto the opposing demo. Uh, sneaky Polar Bear, so that will be a nice swing for <laughs> John Madden in this mid. Most and, wow, uh, a lot of frags coming out in the favor of John Madden, but also, oh, Cole gets several frags. 
Cole hitting up those jumps like it's his job, which it pretty much is, and Drake is left alone with nobody to heal, and we do have a lot of aggression going on here, Vanilla Love going a little bit crazy, taking down that <laughs> gets headshot by Hip Hop, super close range, really nice shot. Uh, looks like Drake just did a good job and backed yeah, out of in there. Interesting <laughs> to note, in that engagement, Malin did uh, get taken out, so Drake will have that full uber advantage. The almost back capped? Oh man, what is going on? All sorts of stuff. Uh, looks like Lex is going to be taken down by Cole. Drake is over here, full for full uber. He's with his demo, he might be getting jumped from Suez. Here he is, Cole goes in for the big bomb, might force the uber. Yes, he does, the uber does get forced out. Flashes his spy, and he is going to be moving in with ODB. ODB chumps all the way into the opposing rollout. He is throwing stickies, and he gets it as well. Oh my gosh, the big chumps, big ups going in here. And uh, that is going to be an easy cap for John Madden here on Mini Spire. Yeah, it's looking right here that <clears throat> John Madden do not want to go home as they are poking their finger into last. Um, I'm thinking they may go for this lobby push again. Most definitely. Neither med has any sort of like uber advantage well, really going on. It looks like Drake is going to be building a little bit better, and they do have some positioning over here in Balcony on those catwalks. Bronze gets taken down by Lex, hitting up that soda popper, and we are having a bit of a passive hold over here. Drake isn't playing super close to rollout because he knows that Cole is just itching to jump him as soon as possible. He pops sniping, sniping Lex over there, and we are getting just a lot better building over here from Drake. He has turned his maybe 10% advantage in to at least the 20. Glad he has. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna watch Philosophy Major here in this uh, rollout engagement of spam. <laughs> <laughs> yep, yeah, not not much going on. We're just doing the whole 5 CP waiting game, waiting for someone to get impatient or make that mistake as Drake does have 100% Uber and it looks like his team is going to be moving into lobby, trying to get a bit more aggressive, doling out those buffs, see if they can do Ooh, Fairover gets a nice headshot onto Cole there, who's maybe gonna try and make something happen, but too late. Watch the respawn timer for a little bit instead. And here we go, Drake over here with his demo, ODB. They're gonna be trying to go in, peeking in a little bit soon, sighting that sentry. The sentry gun does go down, I believe it was many. And the mi both Ubers get popped out over here. Pyro gets taken down, DJ is down, and we do have a much better Uber coming out here, and a lot less people on John Madden. So yeah, ODB a pressuring uh, closing med at Maylent, or excuse me, Drake. Oh yeah, messed up there. Um, <laughs> It's cool. It was a good defense, and it looks like that'll be definitely enough of a player advantage for them to push into and have Cole at least get a little bit of time onto that second point, despite Tsukima getting a nice reflect over there. Ooh, Sneaky getting taken down by Lex as well, so that's definitely going to be a significant advantage, at least class-wise. Cole over here, jumping the sniper. It looks like he does not get fair offer. Instead, Cole gets body shot by him instead. Keep up picking up a nice snipe onto Drake, which leaves Malin with at least 70% to just move in off of, and that is second Battle Bull get taken down, but it doesn't really matter. There's a scout, there's an NG running around behind, but Malin has that 84%, and he's going to hold on to that second. Oh, big jump in by ODB! He tried, and he failed. Sneaky takes it down with the sticky. Almost. So close. So far. So far. <laughs> Oh, bomb coming in from here. Cole, actually, no, he's just jumping the other side of here. Oh, I love anime taking down Evan. Bronze taking down DCSY. Bomb coming in for Soldier. Blue Uber does get popped off, and um, Red's trying to kite it. Uh, it looks like Blue, as in Squirrel Squad, will be taking this mid as <clears throat> the best fun in the game is going to be setting up his little engine nest here in sewer, but it's getting quickly cleaned up by the opposing team as he has to run back and gets taken out by Bronze, who has a 4k right now. Very nice. We do have some positioning over here. Drake is ready to back out lobby as soon as possible. He knows he has this little bit of advantage on Uru, but not many players. Uh, people are bleeding a little bit. Bronze gets taken down by Ambassador Shot and Vanilla Love. Takes down Sneaky Polar Bear, playing that sort of aggressive, almost flanking heavy. He has been playing a little bit more with this combo, this process, as opposed to the past one. And we do have three down, including Sneaky on... Squirrel Squad, so 
Maybe we'll have a little bit more aggression over here. Evan doing some DR work in choke in sewers. So we'll see if we can push as both medics do have Uber. Yeah. Uh, Evan being pretty aggressive spy here. More dead ringers. Um, <clears throat> Game Master pistols down Rolls Royce, unless that was a DR. Uh, and Sneaky taking down that mini. DCSY taking down Evan. ODB taking down Cole with those nice sticks. Another DR. Evan really likes that dead ringer. Hey, it's useful. It, it gives you another chance at life, you know? Well, I mean, that's kind of basically the entire point of it. Evan trying to get pretty aggressive there. Trying to get on Farafer, who just does not care. It takes down Heap Hop as well. Both medics are still holding on to their Uber. Evan over here just running around with his revolver out. Gets taken down once more, I believe. Nope, DR again. And so we're just having a sort of... We're having a little thing going on. Oh, here we go. Cole jumps in through choke. Gets absolutely destroyed by Vanilla Love. Shooting him straight out of the air. Some nice tracking work going on there. Yeah, um, oh, Fair Offer gets another snipe. Yeah, the snipe onto Sneaky, that's gonna be really good as they are moving in through Choke, but it doesn't matter. It looks like they're gonna be, the other team's gonna be rotating into Sewer a little bit. Both Ubers are popped out. People are bumping faces over here. Shiny people running into Shiny people. Um, the blue Uber is going to be a little bit better, less flashing, but I don't think that anyone could really push off that. Sukim is down, and here we go. <laughs> Soldier jumping in, tries to make stuff happen, but Palover just, Palovi, or he just doesn't, he jumps out of sewer, and oh, Sneaky gets taken down once more, ODB setting up some nice sticky, and here we go, Cole going in maybe for the counter jump, it looks like he's gonna do it, here he goes around the corner, he is on Drake, he gets one rocket, and he has to just get out. And uh, Rolls Royce gets taken down as well as he was trying to get into a position behind the medic. So it looks like Squirtle Squad is sort of positioning to move in here. They do have a three man player advantage. People are getting headshot all over the place here, though not necessarily dying. And we're going to have some aggressive taking of Valley over here. The heavy in, we have Sneaky moving in there with Malin. And it looks like maybe we'll finally see someone cap Mini Spire here. But the Mini Sentry is up, so that is a pretty huge deterrent. And Drake is gonna have Uber now. Ooh! Uber's our exchange here. Red's gonna have a little bit better of this exchange as <clears throat> Blue has to try to back up. But uh, Red took a lot of picks there, and Squirrel Squad may be looking to get this second now as they just heal up their players and push on this point as Red clears out. And even though we are approaching this team's last now, this has been a very long round. Almost 10 minutes already, way longer than. The previous rounds almost definitely here we go evan trying to get on on the med dr so he is still hovering around last he's playing that gun spy which is definitely pretty nice to see i like to see that aggressive sort of play style he doesn't manage to get anything down and it looks like cole and sneaky are down on the blue team so they have to wait before they push in Tsukima goes down to dj and uh we're just gonna have red team just sort of content to hold maybe in rollout they know they can be a little bit aggressive the other demo isn't up yet and I don't really see, I don't see Heap Hop peeking. Let's see what he's doing. Here we go. He's looking in lobby right now. Nothing but a mini there. And both medics are approaching 100% Uber. So maybe we'll see a push soon, but likely not. We're probably just going to play the old Highlander waiting game again. Yes, we are. I think we need some elevator music, actually. <laughs> Maybe not. Here we go, Evan, doing some stuff in there again. He popped, taking down that sentry, letting his scouts go in there. Both are in. Um, Palovely is at 9 health, so he's pretty lit. Just a lot of red flashing numbers on the HUD over here. Cole gets taken down by a nice flares and Zukima, but not before he takes down Lex as well. So it looks like blue team decided they should probably hold them maybe a little more back considering they don't have some players up and we do have some aggression over here on balcony we have the pyro and soldier spamming a little bit out here taking a little bit more ground but they either just want to park the bus or make absolutely sure that they can push out and cap second and so they might just wait wait for a wipe before they can push out or wait for a med pick before they can push in who knows yeah that's that's pretty wise Back caps are... Yeah, back caps are a huge pain, that is for sure. Rolls Royce is behind the entire enemy team right now, hitting up that cloak and dagger, I guess, calling position. 
ODB taking down a DRing Evan once more. Well, making him feign at least. And so I'm just kind of waiting for Rolls Royce to do something. The other team is really aggressive. They're moving into Shudder, um, taking a little bit of ground there. Heap Hop is going to be peaking a little bit more aggressively as well. Cole is down. He's been trying to jump in and make plays happen for a while. Yeah, uh, best fun in the game setting up his engine. Oh, nope. Bronze takes out that sentry gun pretty quickly, but another many already up, as those things only cost, what, 150 metal to build? Yep, Farafer uh, goes down to a nice snipe and looks like Sneaky thought he could get aggressive there, but it doesn't matter because Lex is all over him with that soda pop and take him down really nice. Oh, Zakima gets another riff, Lex rocket on Cole, just denying the heck out of him. And so we are just going to get a reset in here. It's a shame that Sneaky went down because they might have been able to push off that sniper pick and it looks like they were about to. Yeah, um, we're going to see... Oh, he pop takes down that mini as um, Evan gets a stab on ODB. That's a big pick. Um, whether or not that's enough for them to push off of, I'm not sure. We still have those equal Ubers. Oh, man. Uh, you can tell when NGs get bored. You want to know how you can tell? Because Game Master is on level 3s right now, and it looks like he wants... It. If he sets up a cheeky level 3, I will be very, very happy. Cole is actually on direct hit right now. I guess those minis are sort of driving him crazy. And, uh, he's down. Both medics still have that uber. Oh, here we go, Zukima trying to get something in on there. Ferrofer gets a snipe on a hip. He pop. ODB takes down Evan. DJ is down, and the uber finally does get forced. Good play over there, and people are just gonna have to jump out. It looks like Drake is just gonna sit up there on second, and they're gonna cap, and Mallant has his Uber. He used it to go away, and it looks like that is gonna be a jump in, and Cole gets tracked out of the air. Really nice yeah, play he, there. Yeah, he cratered. Um, we're gonna see if this momentum can be pushed into mid, and um, maybe we're gonna have a recap here. The Ooh, snipe nice onto ODB snipe, though, yeah. yeah. Alright, so I think we might be able to hold mid just because not having ODB up on that demo means that they have a lot less going on. And we do have a level 3 sentry. Game Master got bored, built a level 3, and now that is going to be a significant point of defense for the Squirrel Squad. We're almost halfway done with this game as this round is almost approaching 15 minutes, wow. Um, Most definitely. Ooh, Rolls Royce getting on that. Gets a nice headshot. Finally takes down Heat Pop, which maybe opens up an avenue for his team to peek a little bit more. And we are getting a little bit of aggression going in here. ODB peeking a little thing. They know that level 3 is there. He's trying to get. Oh, here we go. The Uber gets popped out from Mallet. He's going to save his head. His demo tries to jump. Goes straight up in the air. RIP Sneaky. That was almost awesome. And here we go. The Red Uber does get popped off as well and that sentry is still up it is on the roof of sewer doing a really good job of denying and drake goes down to it as well he has a 4k with that sentry right now level three and that means squirtle squad is just gonna try and push in a second maybe try and take down that roaming heavy that they have but they probably might not be able to make it just because spawns came up yeah that's that's some funny level three plays going on right now Absolutely. Cole over here, it looks like he's might be getting aggressive, might be able to jump in. No, we do have the loose cannon still being played by ODB. We have a pretty nice sightline by Farah. For Rolls Royce, once again, takes down Heap Hop, putting on that pressure on the sniper, doing a really good job, especially if he can't get close to the combo. That means he's... Oh, Mally gets dropped by him! Just as I say he can't get close, he gets really close and just shoves the knife in his back. Super nice play. Demo trying to take down... Finally, level 3 goes down, but it doesn't matter because it looks like Bronze is going to just go all the way behind. And that mini was down. He finally gets taken out by left. And somebody needs to go and cap mid. That level 3 is down, but both medics went down as well. And we might as well just reset as Game Master is building up his level 1 on those crates, on those houses. On those crates, on those houses. And I Love Anime takes out Evan, unless that's DR. Um, <clears throat> pretty cool ubers right now as we have that reset of the waiting game and this round is so long i keep saying it but i don't know maybe whoever gets this first win is gonna be the winner of the map i don't know uh maybe um really though 
Cole is uh, moving in. Looks like the entire team is actually moving in through Sewer. Somebody scouted it out as a weak link. They're gonna take down Let. He pop gets a nice snipe on him. He is running Machina right now. And uh, Malin is approaching 90% Uber, so he will have it before. And honestly, they're, both teams are kind of turtling right now. We do have a level 3 once more up in the same spot. Malant does have Uber. Drake is only at 80% right now, so if they want to go in and get aggressive, they should. But it looks like both teams are sort of content to just wait it out they super passively. Oh, here we go. Big jump in coming in here from Sneaky. He just comes in, pipes Drake, and then Drake gets dropped. Well, killed by Cole, not necessarily drop, which was Mount with 100% Uber. Super nice play over there, and finally... And kill by Sneaky on the best one in the game, <laughs> and Bronze takes down I Love Animal. This is a really... Oh, Uber comes off, and um, as they were faced, it's going to be a nice and easy, hopefully, second cap for Skull Squad, as only one up for the opposing side. And yeah. whether or not they can push this into last, they're going to have about a 30% Uber advantage. I think that will be significant enough to the point where they will be able to push in last. Maybe, maybe, but people are building pretty hard right now, and honestly, Highlander in general, where it struggles on 5 CPs, a lot of teams just have trouble being as aggressive as maybe they should be. They never know where to push. We still have those offensive level 3 sentries. It looks like Game Master is going to be sentry jumping onto that little ledge above balcony to watching roll out. So anyone who tries to peek there is going to get a nasty surprise of sentry to the base as well as up in lobby. Although that's going to be spammed out fairly easily. But then again, Rescue Ranger Wrangler. All right, Mallet pops the Uber in. He's trying to get it and goes in on Cole on his demo. Oh, Drake, Drake. is just pipe absolutely demolished by Sneaky, and they're going to be going up into the upper area trying to make stuff happen, but Battle Bull is coming up behind, playing cleanup crew, just bad health all over the place. ODB, Rolls-Royce are the only two that are up, and Rolls-Royce is... ODB, only Ouch. person up here. Uh, uh, can ODB he takes fend down off Malin. the attack from two players here? Oh, can I ODB... Believe... Oh, no! Oh, no! No Battle cap Bull. time yet, so <laughs> they are getting some spawns here as... Wow, John Madden is able the to level hold on three there. Century. I called it. This is ridiculous. Oh, I hope he gets taken down. It finally does. Lex manages to take it out, but that was a really clutch defense there by ODB. Battle Bull was only at 60 health, and he finally managed to get taken down. It looks like we might have a repush here as well, trying to get some caps in, but Cole's over here jumping around. He's going to be trying to get out. He gets mowed down as well. And it looks like neither team wants to give up the second point as we have a lot of really just scrappy fighting going on. People flying all over the place. Heavy v heavy. Both heavies get taken down. Rolls Royce whiffs a bit of a stab on Mallant over there. Sets focus on the sniper instead. Manages to make it out. Not quite. Gets picked by Heap Hop. So, uh, reset. Wow. What a chain. Chain reaction. Um, <laughs> uh... Wow, okay, another push coming out? Uh, no, just... Wow, that was really aggressive. Um, they didn't have the Uber and they were already pushing in there. Uh, but now they oh, are... Evan, Evan, Evan does he get it? Oh, Evan gets ODB! No, ODB gets headshot before Evan can backstab. Mallet has 100% and it looks like Evan's gonna try and go for the medic and he gets the mirror while we're straight down! Oh, that is a full, full Uber advantage to push into last. They really need to take advantage of that and move in. And here we go. Lex actually forces off the Uber, wasting that time, those precious seconds, trying to get that heavy and demo through. And that Uber's going to be out already. Battle Bull gets headshot as soon as that Uber fades. Super good play there by Fairafer. And Malin gets taken down by Sticky from ODB. And it looks like they're going to be able to defend this. Yeah, um, big snipe there. A lot bigger than... Wow. Okay, so, uh... Polar Bear taken down. Zushima, nice kill streak here as gets the kill with the flare gun and then <laughs> chains with the flame fur. ODB takes down DJ with a nice pipe. And are they going to be able to push in a second? Not, oh, not with that level 3 right there, though. Game Master keeping, keeping that oh, level 3 up. It level finally three goes taken down. Out. Yeah, wow. Yeah, enough to waste a lot of time on it, though. But Drake is going to have some... Drake is going to have Uber a lot sooner, and it looks like people are capping point. Zukima decides to go up there and get stuff done. He is going to get jump and got revenge on. Cole gets revenge on Zukima, and so we're probably going to have a reset as maybe they should have pushed out. Uh, John Madden should have pushed out a bit earlier, knowing they had that Uber advantage and the other team didn't have that heal, those heals. Nah. 
Medics are just crutches for bad players. <laughs> oh, big Most. stab coming out here. Yeah. Evan takes out ODB and DCSY takes down Evan in response. But <clears throat> with that demo pick coming down um, and Maylin almost having his Uber, we should see a push in fairly soon. Hopefully. One would hope, at least an attempt at a push. Rolls Royce is behind the enemy team. Looks like the other team does go through, and we do have Ubers popped off on lap. People, medics being bounced up into the air. It's just on Zukima and his soldier right now. Vanilla have got backstab. Heap Hop got <laughs> freaking hedge. Mallet manages to make it out. Cole is near on the medic. He gets off a rocket. It doesn't matter. This good surf by Drake straight into the arms of Bronze. Bronze goes down by a really nice pipe by ODB. And that is going to be a good defense with just Evan over here trying to get stuff done. Malin is alone at about 50 health. Picking his Ooh. head in here into last, but he's going to back out. Man, oh man. And that is... We're, we're just going to... We have eight minutes left on the map, and nobody is capped yet. Jeez. This is the complete polar opposite of what happened in the first uh, process. <laughs> yeah, neither team wants to give it up, man. Uh, here we go, Cole. Maybe he'll get a little bit aggressive in here. Nah, he decides to back out a little bit. And, um... Uh, gosh, I didn't, never thought process would be such a stalemate map. Of all the map stalemates, it's usually... Gully Watch and Snake Water. He pop gets a really nice snipe there onto Vanilla Love. That's going to be a pretty good pick. Here, giving Bronze the opportunity to walk right in, and Malin gets headshot by Farafer. Boom, that was a drop, wasn't it? And so they're going to be definitely trying to push it with that Uber, but Cole is behind. He's going to get cleaned up really easily, though, by Lek. And they're just kind of being bullied out of lobby right now. I guess Red Team just isn't going to push off of this. Drake does have 100%. And Malin has just spawned, has not started healing yet, so they really need to get some picks in here. But Sneaky catches out Tsukima, who is out of position. Evan, you know, drawing some attention back onto that point. We really just need to get some players moving in around here. Yeah. Um, I was surprised they didn't go for that push on the second point. Um, not sure how many chances they're going to get as time is ticking down. Whew. Watching stuff happen. A nice snipe onto DJ by Farafer. Lovely gets taken down by those flames as well. Mallet has 50% Uber, I believe. Yes, he does. And Drake is just holding on. He's sitting on that Uber. It looks like they're just content to park the bus, I guess. Uh, it's kind of unfortunate. And, you know, Process is actually a pretty fast map once it gets played. You can park it. Be just because last is so big, you have to really focus your attention maybe three completely different places. The sentry, the combo, whatever rumor is jumping behind you. So, we're just waiting yeah, for Malin's guess, for now. I guess the John Madden is a little tense here, maybe. They're just trying to sit tight and not give up the round. Just being really defensive, not too aggressive, obviously. Um, maybe they're just going to hold it out until there's a golden cap at 0-0 zero, zero, and maybe set the... Uh, Clean, clean the slate with um, a new mid and potentially their own last push. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. Uh, Bronze went in there, got a really nice pick onto Farafer, so his team can peek a little bit more. Malin and Drake sitting on 100%. We have level threes up on both sides. Still up in that kind of cheeky spot. Game Master having a little bit of fun there with the Wrangler, throwing some rockets around. Tsukima maybe trying to flank a little bit. All right. CP, nah, he's not going to go in. There's a sentry there. He knows better than that. Uh, Evan DRing once more pretty aggressively on point. We do have Sneaky over here hiding a little bit in shut for throwing some pipes out. Cole getting a move on. He's going to jump in, try and get a rocket in, but no avail. He's just going to be jumping up, trying to get that whip off. Cole gets piped. Uh, no, sorry. Gets absolutely denied him. Philosophy Major actually pipes Drake and Drake dropped. That was a really nice play over there and the blue Uber gets popped in. Malin is going to be taking his team in as aggressively as he possibly can, flashing his demo, flashing his pyro, people getting caught behind, Rolls Royce getting caught out. This Plenty could two. be... Oh no, wow. <gasps> nice picks coming out as the med is left alone and taken out. Oh my wow, god. Nice pipe there by ODB, but it's on the point. The finally, oh my the god. spy cap. With the taunts and the burp by that demo, it is finally going to be... That point is going to be awarded to Snoopy Polar Bear. One oh. Squirtle longest squad ever. <laughs> longest round yeah. ever. Really though. All right. 
we'll see here that Philosophy Mater says easy in chat, like that was easy or something. But I'm gonna watch um, ODB here at mid. Um, <clears throat> well, no frags yet at mid. Um, we see Battleble taking that aggressive spot on that crate there at mid. <clears throat> and fair effort, nice snipe on Game Master. ODB takes down Cole, and I Love Anime takes down Evan. Drake getting the <clears throat> the uh, crossbow. crossbow kill, yeah, onto that sentry. But that is going to be a pretty definitive cap over here. But Malant man Malant managed to make it out with 100% Uber. We do have Fair Effort peeking, trying to make stuff happen. Drake 100%. A Squirtle Squad just really started bleeding players over there. Their NG went down. Their uh, of just people going in cold doing some jumping over there, and it looks like Drake just decided to pop his Uber off onto ODB, and Melon counters with an Uber zone that's gonna be quite a bit better. He's gonna be Ubering his scout and soldier, and uh, just people bouncing around all over the place. Red Heavy actually gets backstabbed. Farafra gets taken down by the pocket pistol from Bronze. Cole takes down Palovely. Um, Lex takes down Bronze. ODB getting a nice pipe onto DJ. And it looks like we are having some contesting going on here. Lex is going to be going on there. Zukima is getting tracked out of the air, lands on the sniper. Will he burn out? Yes, he does. He pop gets flared from up in the air, and that point is going to get capped by John Madden, it looks yeah, like, nice, unless someone decides to jump. Nice, uh, <laughs> nice fries coming out there as it is crunch time now for John Madden. They are in kind of desperation mode as they need to win this round within the next two minutes and 30 seconds force that golden cap and not be eliminated from this tournament. I mean, Drake does have that 100% uber, Cole does get caught out in lobby. He finally dies, it took quite a bit of time, and they're gonna have to go pretty soon if they want any semblance to be able to move in, but they just don't really have the heal, or necessarily the positioning to be moving in here. Evan once more DRing behind, Sneaky setting up some traps on Shutter right there, and uh, getting some Machina, Machina action, both medics do have it right now, so here we go! Let's yeah. see how long they park the bus this time. Yeah, not much time here, only one, uh, excuse me, one minute 50 seconds left right now. And uh, Game Master has a level 3 setup near that left spawn for blue. And um, ODB actually went down to Sneaky's trap, I believe. Went out to some Sneaky's over there, so that's going to delay any semblance of a push. And Cole gets tracked out of the air by the Red Heavy, sorry. Oh, the backstab though on the red heavy. It keeps happening. Keep Hop gets taken down by Zukima. We're getting a little bit more aggression over here, especially with Sneaky down and Cole down. They might be able to move in here. Palovely is actually on the direct hit right now. Get, gets his direct hit reflected, trying to take down that level three sentry pirate doing a good job of protecting stuff on there. And we do have the Uber out on point. ODB is Ubered, countered by an Uber on Battle Bull and the soldier Palovely. And so they're gonna be chased straight out and it is only four up on john madden a really nice defense there and it doesn't look like vanilla love is going to be in a position to get there i think he just spawned recently he just got to second and so they might be able to get out but lovely gets a good direct hit onto both sneaky and melee jeez that weapon absolutely crazy and so that is definitely probably gonna save them the round at least as we do have Evan over here, decloaking, maybe trying to get some work down, takes down the red heavy, sort of stymieing that push once more. People are just getting thrown onto the point here, into the sentry. This pyro just gets taken down. It's just ODB and his medic sort of in. 20 oh. seconds left. They gotta go and oh, gets taken down by a sticky. Lex is going a little crazy over there in lobby. He gets takes down Sneaky as well. Peep, there is time on point. But it is kind of a losing battle over here as nobody is in position. Seven so seconds left. Ooh, the final countdown. Oh, here Three, we go. The Villa Love going in with the No, not quite. Wow. Wow, that was insane. So, Squirrel Squad are champions. G. G. <laughs> what a game. What a set of matches. In what a hold on process. Good lord, a 20 minute process round is absolutely insane.